No, no, no healing soup for you. Wake up! Get your hands off me, worm! <laughs> I'm not the one in the dirt. One last thrust. And I'll be free of you. I'll never have to fear you again. But if I finish the ritual you started, I'll never have to fear anyone. Ever. You think me a fool? That I would allow anyone to usurp me, speak the words, and ascend in my place? Hm? The runes I carved into your flesh bind you and all 7,000 souls to the ritual. Complete it, and those bearing the scars will be sacrificed. You included. You are simply a means to an end. I made you to be consumed. I am so much more than what you made me. I can do this, but I need your help. I need your eyes, in a manner of speaking. What do you think you are doing? I'm making what you made me. Use the parasite. Link your mind to mine. Through your eyes, I can see the scars on my back and copy them onto his. You would not dare! I would. And I will. You will be consumed, and all the power you've lusted after will be mine. To sacrifice so many will be an abomination! Help me do this. Please. Your minds join and your two selves become one. You can feel the knife in your hand, see the scars on his back, and taste his hunger for power. Yes. Yes. I see it. What are you doing? Don't! Ah! Oh, no! Oh, no! No! Ungrateful child! Wretched child! Time to take your place. lives at stake. We cannot allow this to happen. Don't you dare. I can feel their power flowing into me. Nunc foro potestantum quam politicus es me. I can't feel it. 
That ache in my stomach. That hunger. It's gone. I'm free. I'm finally free! Oh! Oh, it feels delicious! I did. We did. Come on, let's get out of here. I have a brand new world to explore. This is it. The hopeless dream dreamt by all of my kind. I am the greatest vampire to ever walk this land. Even the Pale Knight would have knelt before me. I felt so very little for so long. My edges dulled over the numb years rotting in the boudoir and kennels. Now, I can hear it at last. See it at last. How oh, all the lowly creatures of this plane are begging to serve. <laughs> How to call upon them. Scurrying footpads in their safe houses. Rats below our feet in their filthy holes. The crows in the night above! They will obey. The world will stir in fear. The spawn. It won't take long to get a new army. I'll make new ones soon. I already hear the world whispering in sweet surrender. And I feel alive. <laughs> I had hoped to avoid this path. I had hoped you would choose the better road. A fool I was to ever hope a beast like you could be saved. Oh, please. There's no need for such language. I promised you Cazador's death, and I more than delivered. I even killed a few thousand spawn whilst I was at it. You should be thanking me for saving you the trouble. No, there's no working with the likes of them. Look at the hate in their eyes. We gave you a choice, and you chose power, as your kind always does. But I still have hope for you, that you will make a better choice. Will you stand against evil? Will you help us destroy this monster? There is not. <laughs> My dear, I wouldn't want it any other way. Kill them. Kill them all.
Is... Is it over? Yes. It's over. You can do whatever you want. As for those... wretches in the cells. If I don't get my freedom... Neither do they. <sighs> it's over. <laughs> I'm done with this. And I'm done with you. I would say good luck out there, but honestly... I hope you die, Scrooge. You leave with your work half done? Cazador may be dead, but you would leave thousands of spawn trapped in those cages? is difficult to hear. Perhaps you were right to leave things as you did. We should finish this ourselves. Thank you for giving us this choice. For giving us a chance to see them one last time. These people died years ago. Trust me on that. All that's left are feral spawn, desperate for blood. If we release them, how many people will they kill? Tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands. But if I complete the ritual, think of the power I'll have. With me by your side, we can, we can save the city. We can save ourselves. see the fear in his eyes, but also the hunger. The thick smell of blood in the air and the promise of power being so close is intoxicating to him. All he can see is the power of the ritual and the freedom that power brings. The freedom to do anything, to be anything. Above enjoying this. Is it over? Is he...? <sighs> yes. He's gone. What does that mean for us? It means you have a choice. You can hide here. 
living in the shadows like parasites. Or you could be more than what he made us to be. You can choose differently, of course. But the consequences are on your head. And what does it mean for them? Now, that's a better question. 7,000 spawn from ancient conquests to stolen children. Casador's staff controlled everything during the ritual. If it controls the cells too, you could decide their fate. Good. They deserve a chance at life. Nature will handle their fates from here. No. She's right. The poor wretches in the cells are innocent. They shouldn't have to suffer just because I... lured them here. someone to lead them. Take the tunnels into the Underdark. Find somewhere, well, not safe, but less perilous. What? No, we can't. Just try to keep them out of trouble. I think we're done here. Let's go. That's it. He's gone. After all these years, these centuries, it's really over. I'm glad you think so, because I'm not so sure. I just feel numb. What I've lost. <laughs> what I've gained. It's all so much. And God, all those spawn. Free in the Underdark. I need some time, I think. I. just to let it all sink in. <laughs> Let's just go. This place reeks of death, and I want to feel alive again. You killed one vampire, but released 7,000 of his spawn. Have you lost all sense? They were innocents. To kill them would have been an even greater crime. Uh, but if you do decide to go hunting them... No, they include your... Children. They... Oh, they survived? Well, that depends on how you define survived, really. But they are free. They're making their way into the Underdark as we speak. This is... difficult news. We will need to decide what it means. Thank you for what you have done. Slaying Cazador was a great justice. As for the rest, well, time will tell. And when they're dead, will you kill us too? We're not like those wretches, brother. We've spent lifetimes controlling our hunger. They're all but feral. I don't relish it any more than you do. But putting them to rest may be the kindest thing we can do. All 
those lives just snuffed out. I hope it was worth it. Astarian. Follow the tunnels to the Underdark. We'll be, well, not safe there, but in less peril. I think we're done here. Let's go. You killed not only Cazador, but also his wretched creations. I expected less. So I can see from all your heavily armed friends. You didn't think I could resist completing the ritual, did you? I admit, I had my doubts. But where are our children? What of their fate? I... <sighs> I'm sorry. We were too late. Cazador had already turned them. So when you destroyed the spawn, you killed them too? They died long before we arrived. Trust me. They were not the children you knew. Perhaps. But the choice should still have been ours. You have taken them from us twice now. I have. I've stolen your last chance to see them. And I'd do it again in a heartbeat. Because anything else would mean sending you down into the dark. It means showing you the hunger in your babe's eyes and leaving you with that. Terrible final decision. I visited enough pain on your people. The least I could do was spare you that. Perhaps there was something to that. A kindness I would not have credited you with. Well, that's backhanded as compliments come, though I'll take it if it means you're done trying to kill me. I never dreamt a spawn could find redemption, but... Yes. You will never be hunted again. As for you, you have my people's thanks. I know you face trials ahead. We will stand with you as best we can. Until then, go in peace. And thank you. It feels so good. Freedom. True freedom. Finally, I can feel my strength growing. Every day that passes, I gain new abilities. You know, now that our enemies have fallen, I might be the most powerful person in the world. And as you're my consort, that makes us the most powerful people in the world. And neither would I. Together, we can do anything. The world is ours for the taking. So, what would you like? Then you shall. We'll travel the lands together, tasting everything Faerun has to offer. Perhaps we'll find somewhere we'd like to stay for a century or two. Perhaps not. We have a beautiful, bloody future to look forward to, my love. I can't be sure what it holds for us, but I know one thing. This is going to be fun! <laughs> Oh, darling, I love the way you think. We will need to be careful, of course. There are still powerful forces in the city. We can start slowly, quietly charming and manipulating key figures, building up our network of puppets. 
Before long, we'll have our hands on every string in the city, and they will dance however we tell them to. We have a beautiful, bloody future to look forward to, my love. I can't be sure what it holds for us, but I know one thing. This is going to be fun! <laughs> Hello, darling. I was just thinking about... freedom. How I'm... free of the parasite. Free of Cazador. How I'll never be in someone's power again. And all it cost was my life in the sun. <laughs> Now I belong to the shadows. So, what happens next? True, the spawn will need someone to lead them. Otherwise, I'll just be a murderous, blood-sucking horde. Although, <clears throat> I couldn't help but notice you said we should find them. Is that what you want? Is this what you want? I would understand if you wanted to go your own way. <sighs> Good. Because, selfless as I am, I really did not want to let you go. We are rather excellent together, you know. And united, there is nothing we can't do. I can't say what the future holds for us, but I know we'll be facing it together. And we're going to have a lot.